Alrighty, and we're off. I'm gonna be the first one to access the Buddha Mega Health. Alright, we got dudes POV this game because uh, I think Steph was requesting that. Yes. Alright, Steph, hey, we're Steph watching dude. Start streaming. And I'll need to be on the other side of the bridge. I'm gonna go through the teleport. I'm gonna spam an orb to keep the Oh, was it a black screen? Did I push something? Here, one sec. Okay, you should be able to see it now. Excellent, excellent. Meanwhile, Valen at the RPG back mag area due to camping the Buddha. The first spawn of the Buddha will be about 60 seconds into the map. These new power-ups that are grandfathered by a new guy have a default cooldown. Valen gonna camp at Buddha first due to be rushing in from the top side. No, he's camping a bit in between Charger and Buddha. Maybe he's gonna let Valen take him to the top side. Nope, he's gonna camp right there and wait for the spawn. Nice day, nice still at nade. 150 HP. Dude on his heels now, gonna go to the top side of the charger area. Here's on the long range there. Doesn't deflect the barrel though. That took away his stack. Still no frags because the combatants are defeated quite well. Dude taking control of the charger. Mainly meanwhile, gonna fall back to the RPG. We'll be ready in about 30 seconds. And while camping the water wheel, here's those batteries there. Once an anticipation shot, Valen is not going to give it to him. Now rethinking his life choices is going to think about <laughs> going to the alley, then give away his position there. Pretty well done by Valen. Maybe going to camp the top side of Buddha. Valen going to again go to RPG. Might think about taking it. So class one maps like this map and air fusion player out. More Buddha control for Valen. He also heard the ringling bells of the RPG. Looks like he is going for it. Valen playing the role of the sergeant. Hearing that, a beautiful shotgun nade and then blows it up with, with a beautiful timed shot of that barrel. <laughs> you're gonna go, if you're gonna go for control items, you gotta clear those barrels, guys. And yes, that gives away your position. That's how the game works. That's why I don't like that barrel off the dude's left right now. I'm not sure what hazard that's justifying. Meanwhile, Valen should see dude right now, and then does, he gets a nice. headshot from behind. Beautiful headshot. Tying the game up, Valen at the water wheel now, dude is doing the pressure. Shoot that SMG nade out of midair, what the hell is this, World War II and a flat gun? God damn. <laughs> Valen gonna rush the underside of Charger, D dude should see him there. Valen gonna pop through the helpful probably, no, he doubles back for a back shot. Does not play out well. Two. Yes, he does. Valen on his Valen's heels now, hurting. just gave away his position. He's gonna try looping around. He's gonna shoot his shotgun early. He Get a little bit sweaty with that grip. Got a lot of perspiration on dude right now. Yeah, Valen's really controlling the power-ups on this map, which is good to yep. see. Yes, it is. Well, dude, let's try to get use a bump. Ah. Did not land any of his shots and a ricochet, or should I say, fall back, fade away, magnum headshot gives Valen lead in this match. Dude, meanwhile, the teleport entrance is going to pop through. Valen hearing that is going to get himself some SMG nades. Loses his position, though. He wanted to rush that top side. Dude's waiting Dude, still meanwhile, there. now has the above ground. Going to try downhill shot and does not work. An uppercut shotgun. With Valen, Valen should be not able to get the boot. It should be up soon. Yeah, but he is able to do these out of position shots because he knows he has the control of the power ups. Dude, meanwhile, going to pop through and Valen's lap. I'm gonna spam these SMG nades and mop up with a shotgun. Best way to beat dude in a mag fight is make it so his mag isn't that useful. Alan going the way of the cipher on this map, controlling every single key point. Dude, meanwhile, it gets out of position, doesn't hear any footsteps, and gives away his flank to Alan with Mazda. And again, some spawning momentum there with the shotgun gives Alan a commanding 6 1 lead in this match. Free RPG. Map. Yep. RPG and a free RPG. <clears throat> RPG will next be up at 4.30. I believe Valen has been controlling the Buddha on the dot, so at five minutes we should see another respawn. I really hate how we're calling that a Buddha and that Mega Health, but whatever, I can't change anything. Well, Valen's spamming some rockets. We're gonna trap dude. Nope, dude, it'll wiggle through. Dude might have his there. first Buddha. Oh, never mind, he's going away from it now. Yeah, he's, 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 he
was able to get a mag there. Could consider pushing up. Honestly, dude, with the way he was able to use his mag on this map in the earlier tournament, he might not have learned any of the item timings. The Buddha being at 60 seconds, the RPG being at 2 minutes. And then Vader wow, nice with shot. an excellent, Holy an shit. excellent, that was an excellent particular shot from across the map. Dude now spamming a nade, accidentally picking up a health pack. Bailing meanwhile, doesn't need to pursue, is not going to pressure dude with any of his anxiety or frantic nature going on now, trying to get in control of this match somewhat. Balin being patient, gonna build his stack, make dude come to him. Spam, spamming words for sound coming. Sees dude drop down. Beautiful prediction there, gets the first mag of the fight. Good feeling that pressure all of a sudden has his aimbot get turned off. Eat your heart out, <laughs> Subi Flow. Dude, however, with a defensive mag there, but doesn't have the armor stack to be able to really pursue Balin and get the back. Try bullhorning him now. Charger is now empty. That should respawn in 60 seconds. At 248, you'll see that. Meanwhile, the Buddha should be coming up soon. And dude able to finally get a kill after that five frag run. And he gets and the Buddha control. Yep, that was the big thing. Balin got a big grunt there. Dude was able to for that and get some mag kill. And then with that stack, dude able to build some frag momentum of his own. Balin, despite getting two mags, loses that fight. Dude now with the rocket gun, he's able to time because he saw Valen with it. Trying to wake up and get some more powers. But wow, then Valen. That was a very <laughs> random orb. <laughs> that was. A, yes, it was. Yes, it was. That takes away dude's momentum, but he gets it right back with a downward angle shot of that shotgun. Valen able to spam that nade there, hearing dude walk down. Thank you, Area Portal, for allowing us to hear that set of footsteps. Meanwhile, dude at the Buddha area is going to think about rushing the back alley. Valen's going to peek a little bit. Dude camping by water wheel, to waiting to surprise yeah. Valen. Dude getting a bit impatient now, is feeling the pressure of the time. With his Buddha stack, though, he could be pushing for the mags here. Gets the first mag on Valen. Valen's going to fall back in the back alley. Dodging that SMG nade. It's another fadeaway mag. Kickoff was nice. Feeling the pressure here, and then is able to do a beautiful anticipation SMG nade shotgun combo. Again, going very much the way of the cipher, controlling all of that spam. In addition to the majority of the power ups. Dude, hoping to keep his control of the Buddha going, but here's go at the charger. Try getting a pickoff mag. Misses the first shot. Gets the second shot. Okay, I need to think about spamming orbs. He forces dude to slow his roll, catch it. Okay, I'm gonna go for the Buddha control right now. Getting more SMG nades. Dude able to get a, it, picking up on that pattern though, and was able to really surprise him. <laughs> Outflanking him and should get Buddha here. And he does. The final Buddha would be with 33 seconds left. For the four frag limit. Four frag lead, dude's gonna be feeling some pressure. Balin gonna be playing very defensively. Dude's just gotta get out of his comfort zone and get a lot of downward speed to ca like catch Valen. This is game four. And Valen is leading the game. This is the fourth, yes. So this is a match map. If dude wins this map, he'll have to win lockdown to win the match. Valen doing a hit and run thing. Continuing to spam dude again the way of the cipher. That's slowing dude's ability to do any offense or fire any of those rockets. And well into the advantage of Valen here. Dude really trying to turn up the tempo. He's rushing the heck out of the back alleys. Valen, meanwhile, being very slippery in his defense. He's gonna try doing a mag here, misses it, doesn't matter. He's gonna go through the teleport, make dude completely reset. Dude is able to get the high ground here. Valen's waiting, dude gets his first shotgun. Take some damage from that right there. Dude with his back, able to weather it. And then Valen mops up with a magnum in beautiful fashion that should secure him this map and the match. Provided there's no miracle magic here. Dude having to be a oh. callback. And mathematically speaking, dude has played well, took one map away from Valenito. This will go down as a 4 1 victory in favor of the Argentine Antlion. 3 to 1, but yeah.
this map is hard. Excuse me, you're right, you're right. Four <laughs> maps play three to one. Apologies, I can do math fine. Fuck you. Beautiful match. Alrighty. That was fun.